This is the air box for the senior 20. Air box for the senior 20 and the air box for the busker are very similar. The air box for the senior 20 is about a half inch longer in this section. It's about an inch and a quarter longer on the side. About one eighth of an inch wider and about an eighth of an inch higher than what the busker is. They're built very similar and they have to be because they play the same music. For those of you who have built model airplanes, putting this together is similar to getting a fuselage ready to go together. We put stiffeners in here and that getting ready for the bulkheads, which is what we've done here. piece of quarter inch plywood will go in here. We'll glue that together and make sure everything's square. A piece of half inch goes back here. We'll take a stick, reinforce this edge or widen this edge. Actually this is a sealing surface for the lid and we'll need a good gasket on here for the lid to seal. So when we put that on there it'll look like this. And we put the two bottom sides on. We have to sand this or cut this at a bit of an angle so we can put these plates in here. This piece gets glued in from the bottom and this is what holds your tracker bar in position. We get the two bottom pieces that go in here. make these pieces. Easiest way to make those is cut them to fit. Crankshaft goes through here. Your handle for playing the organ is here. I intend to use a, a bushing in here. This will press in from the other side. Rewind mechanism goes in through this hole. Your clutch mechanism comes in through here to disengage the drive and that's so you can rewind it. The drive for the spool comes in on this side and that's what drives the take up spool. And the hole in the bottom, this is where the air comes in from the reservoir. And this is clearance for one of the connecting rods. Making the air box square and as perfect as possible is going to be key to your organ playing well. This needs to be square in all directions, square corners, square to the table. And the main reason for that, the air box being square has direct impact on how the music tracks across the tracker bar and goes through here. Music comes off the supply spool, tracks across the tracker bar and goes onto the take up spool. If this is not square, if it's not built well, then your music is not going to track properly as it goes over the tracker bar and the holes in the music roll will not properly align with the tracker bar. So this needs to be made as accurately as you possibly can. And one key dimension here is that it's five and a half inches from the back to the center of where the tracker bar is. Two pressure boxes are completed, the lids are completed. These little wires, you need to try to get those in there perpendicular and parallel. This is what sits on top of the tracker bar and pushes down on either side on the paper so that paper goes over the top of the tracker bar and maintains contact. Probably not all that necessary because the Positive pressure inside the box will keep that paper pressed down. Now you need to put the lids on here. Make sure they sit square. 
this one it looks like I need to file this edge away a little bit. These are all hand cut, so there's bound to be a little bit of difference in them. Piano hinge goes here. There'll be a piece of ply covering this side of the piano hinge. The one side of the organ is here, and the other side faces on here. And that will be the next project, making the sides. When that starts to get hot enough, you can see the color changes in the brass as it passes over the flame. 